exist to reduce injuries, fatalities, and losses from uh, crashes that occur on roadways. At the beginning of the crash, what we get is the barrier loading, the front bumper, and a lot of those forces are then transferred directly to the front longitudinal structure inside that's around the engine compartment. And then we start pushing in directly into the wheel and the steering components, which then push, push directly into some of the occupant compartment areas. The occupant compartment held up extremely well, did not collapse around the occupant, and the dummy's injury measures look very good. And the fact that there's no deformation in the A-pillar, a it means that uh, intrusion into the cabin was minimal. One is uh, protecting uh, the occupants. The other is uh, protecting the structure of the passenger compartment. So in a collision, you don't want any uh, intrusion into the passenger compartment. And then the third is having effective crumple zones that absorb the energy. When consumers look for a new vehicle, they should be looking for a vehicle that performs well in a range of different crash modes, front, side, rear impact, rollover, and many new vehicles today come with uh, collision avoidance features that can help reduce or prevent crashes from occurring. Uh, features like forward collision warning or auto brake systems.